That was fascinating. And uh, in the uh, in the lunchroom, we've hidden some robots in the ice today. So, <laughs> not really teasing. All right. So um, to close the day out here, we uh, we're going to be covering our latest super user award winner. This is an award that we give to companies who are using OpenStack in interesting ways and helping to build the community. And to help. Help me present the award winners. I want to uh, bring out the current super users uh, from China Mobile. Hi. Hi, thank Hi. you for joining us yeah, again to, to pass the award along. We have four finalists um, this time around, and, uh, and they come from a variety of, of industries and locations. And this was uh, out of a lot of uh, submissions that we got through the process. The first finalist, they are running 27 data centers of OpenStack with 30,000 customers, and they've gone 100% OpenStack for that. And so our first finalist is City Network. Our second finalist, uh, they have been running OpenStack in production since 2012, and these are the hometown favorites. They have run 100 million CPU hours across about 700,000 instances. And this is Daniela's team. CCL. <laughs> Third, we have a company that went from 500 deployments a week, which already sounds like a lot to me, to over 1,000 a day as they changed their infrastructure and moved it to uh, something that was agile and programmable. Um, they run about 100,000 cores. Okay. Paddy Power, bad fail. They even printed their own shirts. <laughs> and finally, a uh, uh, public cloud in the UK that uh, drives cloud native infrastructure into different government use cases um, like the tax department, uh, the Department of Trade, and across that has saved the government around 600 million pounds. Our final finalist. UK Cloud. <clears throat> OK. So rather than one winner, for the first time ever, we actually had a tie in the voting. And we have two winners. So drum roll, please. Our new super users. UK Cloud oh, and, and Pet Power Bedfell. Congratulations. So come up on stage. Come on over. All right, so this is for UK Cloud. You've got the one for, for Patty Cloud. Congratulations. All right. Let's, uh, let's get a quick picture here. We've got our photographers. <laughs> Come on, Patty Power. Scoot over this way some. All right. <laughs> Say super user. <laughs> All right. Well, thank you very much, and congratulations to our new super users, and thank you to China Mobile as well. So that wraps it up for uh, this morning. And uh, we have uh, a great schedule of content today. Tomorrow morning, we've got another awesome lineup with a lot of demos in the keynotes, um, even more complicated live demos tomorrow. Mark Collier is going to be walking us through that. And you might have seen that we've been teasing. We also have a, uh, a guest speaker that, that's going to be joining us. He's actually going to be joining us remotely from Russia. Um, Mark is going to be interviewing Edward Snowden, who's going to be talking about uh, secrecy and security and uh, openness and what that means for all organizations in, uh, in our technology-driven world today. So um, if you want to suggest some questions for Mark, tweet at Sparky Collier and tell him what to ask Snowden. And with that, thank you for joining us this morning. And make sure that you, uh, you go out there and have a good time with OpenStack. Thank you.